The First Baptist Church of Chattanooga has a woman in a pastor role. They tell me if women are meant to be in the role, then God will call them to it. The polls are closed. The moment polls closed during the 2024 Southern Baptist Convention marked an uncertain period for women in leadership positions for their churches. First Baptist Church of Chattanooga used to be part of the Southern Baptist Convention. They say they parted ways five years ago. In 2019, we made a decision, a public statement, that we were no longer going to affiliate and be a part of the Southern Baptist Convention. Thomas Quinsbury, a pastor at First Baptist, says they have allowed women in leadership positions for decades. In the early 80s, we were able to first ordain women into the ministry. Shortly thereafter, mid-80s or so, we were able to um, hire and recognize the call of someone, a uh, lady, to come on staff to serve as a role of minister. The convention needed a two-thirds majority to pass the resolution. If you wish, yes, it means this that you wish to adopt this amendment into our Constitution. The vote failed. However, the delegation voted 60 percent in support to remove women in pastoral roles. It led to a lot of hurt feelings then within congregations. It led to a lot of uh, scrutiny on women in ministry all across the country over this past year. Ryan Fullerton, pastor at Emmanuel Baptist Church in Louisville, Kentucky, told the Associated Press the measure is not about preventing women from exercising their gifts in the church in roles on church staff as children's ministers. He says the Bible is clear that the office of pastor is for men. Quinsbury disagrees. He says if a woman wants to become a church leader, they should be allowed to. I hope that the young women in those congregations that are feeling a call and a tug to ministry know that there are congregations that recognize that calling in them, that are willing to celebrate that with them. Reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Jacqueline Davis, News Channel 9. We appreciate you making News Channel 9 your trusted source for local news. For more updates on this and other breaking news stories, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications.